afraid that we're gonna have to cut this out because maybe it's resting on something. Looks like over in that corner right over there. Resting on what? Like oh, yeah, it is. Something in the middle there. You can take a hammer and knock that brick out. Okay. We need like one of those big sledgehammers. There we go. Should I go ahead and knock it out? Yeah, go ahead. out of the way. Yep. I just feel like this is a bad place oh, to be standing. I just broke my side. Over? No, yeah, just over top is fine. I'm going to try to just hammer it towards you. Okay. And should I pull? When it's not moving. Cool. This. Or it seems tight. Push it. Right. Hit it there. Okay, hold on. There's a rock in there. Is that what's holding up? See that? Yeah, there is a rock in there. Should I climb in there? I mean, it's not falling. No, just get a shovel. A shovel right here. Try to move it through. Get it lower than lower than the than arch. Form, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, so. There you go. Let's try that. Well, you can clearly thing. see it's the bridge is not moving. Yeah. yeah. That's exciting. <laughs> I don't know. Try dragging it back this way and where you can actually hit at that stone. Are you stuck? I, no, I'm just weak. <laughs> that looks awesome. Yeah, it does. I mean, I don't know. I just don't even know what to say. Part of me is like, is that really gonna work? <laughs> is it? Do it. How am I lowered? Is it? We good? Yeah, we're good. But I feel like this is CGI or something. <laughs> like it's hard to watch you do that. The it's a lot bigger than what I thought when we. Oh my gosh! Okay. Golly. I'd be more celebratory, but uh, we got more work to do. Yeah. Just putting down a layer of dirt to even everything up and fill in any gaps. We put more dirt down here. Don't we have to? We have to build this up to be even. Yeah. Obviously, we're not going to drive the four wheeler like. Did you hook the wagon up? Um, no, we did not. Well, whose idea was that to not do that? I forgot. She didn't know I forgot. Oh my gosh. Now we gotta go back. That's okay though. So now we just gotta get the wagon and get more rock. <laughs> so now we've got to, if this is the base of it, we've got to drop this hillside down to about bottom of that tree or the top of that one. I think we're gonna cut this this little tree out of here. And, but we got the rotor tiller to loosen the dirt and then we'll shovel it down. And then we'll just keep adding stones and dirt and stones and dirt. And then we were trying to add dirt on top but it kept falling through the cracks. So we thought we'll add some, like a layer of cement with the dirt. And then once that gets solid, the stuff would stop falling through. Which that's a, obviously we didn't, 
build this as well as like some professional wood because we had a lot of cracks left in it so and then the dirt layer will help when we go to put the the floor whatever you want to call it floor stones i don't know but for our first bridge i think we did pretty great yeah i think it turned out okay and you know maybe this technically doesn't make it a dry stone anymore but I, that's fine but we don't care bridge and we needed it for hauling firewood so we didn't have to haul it down the creek anymore that's all that matters. Function over function. And it didn't cost us very much money. No, it didn't. It at all. It took us hours and hours of labor. Yeah. And we'll fill this side in first. And then that way we can start back in the wagon right here with rock and then just keep building it well, over to the hillside. Can you get this up to where I can get down a little easy? What do you mean? Just get a layer of dirt on this where it's easier to walk on to get I've got a layer of there. dirt on me. Oh, uh, that's fine. I don't. Have you got enough rocks to do this side? Are you think what? Marshall? Are you thinking we're all going to separate and do different things? No, no, no. Well, yeah, you're going to pack this while I'm tilling that and throwing dirt down here. Oh, yeah. But hauling, but getting the stones, it'll be a lot easier with all three of us. Yeah, yeah but you got some already for over here, right? No, just what you see. Actually, I think this side, like where that, this one over here fell and stuff. I was like edging it with small stones, and then now I realize I was really yeah. stupid. So, go big. yeah, I need to put heavy stones at the edges, and then whatever can go in the middle. Well, what are we gonna do there? We're gonna have to wash it out the roots. Uh, I've been taking a shovel and knocking that down. as the photos and, and anyways we've uh, worked on the edges so you can see we put in bigger stones and um, we built it up higher and put more like a layer of dirt and then a layer of stone uh, as much as we can but clay here good old Kentucky clay uh, tampers down really nicely it packs really well and our goal is to get it even with the top of the bridge and then We'll lay stones on top of this. So he's loosening up the dirt right now. And I don't think it's going to take much more. It surely won't take the three months it took to build it. <laughs> oh, and we'll keep updating y'all. Yeah, we did. We did almost finish this side. We got to go get some more rock because we're kind of, I don't know, that's what you'd say. Just getting what's available rather than getting what is going to work best. If that makes sense but we've got it enough where we could if we had to probably drive the four-wheeler across we got this side about level with the ground above and uh yeah, just about i want to keep this like a hump at the top like very slight so the sides are about done once we get the stone level with the the uh that like landing there the dirt mm -hmm. there then we'll call that good and then we'll do a layer of we'll try to find some big flat stones to lay on top and then we'll shovel dirt on top and we'll sweep all the dirt into the cracks mm -hmm. and then the rain will really clean off the rock and make it look nice mm -hmm. at least that's the goal we'll see how it all goes mm -hmm. 